Hi, it's Sophia Shores here, and I'm going to be doing my project on Minecraft. So, I'm doing my project on Cinder by Maurice Meyer, Choice Minecraft Art, as you can see on the sign. So first, I'm going to read my intro, or summary, sort of. So just let me just go my post, and I'll start. Now. Imagine what it would be like to enter a beautiful castle you've only been to once or twice because your very mean stepmother would never let you go to the castle and the only reason you got to go once or twice was to see the prince to give him back his android you fixed. Your stepmother was always making you be the one fixing all her broken electronics and made you wash her hover. Even your stepsisters give you jobs to do but one of them is very nice and you like her a lot. Back to the castle. You walk in with your dead step sister's dress, your boots, and your cyborg leg that you've had since you were ten, and the pair of beautiful pr gloves Prince Kai gave to you as a present for fixing his android, which your other mean stepsister ruined because she was jealous. Also, there's a plague going around, and your si nice sister and many other people have died from the plague with no cure. You go to the entrance, and the guards let you in, which is very surprising because of the way you look. You go to the ballroom and walk past all the guards who don't even flinch as well. You walk into the room and a person comes by asking, where is your invitation? You give it to him and he gives you a shocked look. He then says, Miss Lin, so glad you could make it. You are the personal guest of Emperor Kai. He then puts a microphone to his mouth before you could stop him and says, the personal guest of Emperor Kai, Miss Lin, is here. The room goes silent and you see your stepmother and sister with their mouths wide open. Before you notice, Emperor Kai has you in his arms and you are dancing with him. Everyone stops to watch the two of you dance across the floor and Emperor Kai encourages the other people to dance with, with you, but no one moves for a while and then people start to join in. So, we're gonna go down, and that's Wolfie, he'll be joining us today. Um, I'm going to drink this potion so I can be quicker, and also so we can see, and I'm gonna splash this on him, which I failed. <laughs> I do not have very good throwing skills. Wait, and I'm gonna show you guys like little towers at the top, what is inside, it's pretty cool after I, go above and go beyond. Hopefully I can open up these doors. I usually can never open up these doors. As you see, never can go through them. Super annoying doors. So as we go up here, there's torches and paintings, and then there's a little cactus, and a bed, and a chest, and you, there's more paintings. Um, you could sleep here if you wanted to. Stay at like, you know, if you were invited, you could stay the night. Why don't I press the button? Press the button. Press the button. Okay. Then I have a second one, which is practically the same thing. So now we're gonna go inside, and I'll make sure I close the door this time because I accidentally left some in. So that's guard, and there's servants here as well. There's another guard, and then this is the army, very tall, bulky, kind of a bit scary. And then this is a fountain, which I fell into and cannot get out of. Um, as it had pretty patterns. This is also part of the army who does not have his name tag. Where's the one with his name tag? There's one. There he has his name tag. And if we go up here to the stairs, this is like if you want to be a creepy room. This is where like you spy on people if you want to be creepy. And then there's like this cool little book thing over here that opens and closes by itself, see? Okay, it's closed right now. It's open, it's closed. It's open, it's closed. Well, I can't really see what he's in the way, but you guys, see, you guys know what I mean, it's pretty cool. And if we go into here, which is my favorite part of the whole castle, which is the gallery. You can sit here, watch everybody, and look at the pretty paintings. I'm also wearing a tuxedo, by the way, if you guys need to, need to know. And so, there, I uh, also, if we go over here, this is another place where you can spy and be creepy on the people who are being creepy and spying back on you. And now we're gonna shrink down the size so we can go into the scene of the book. Yay, we did it! And close that. So this is um, the scene. So this is uh, her stepsister and stepmother. She dropped her glass apparently. And a few seconds ago you saw Prince Kai and Cinder. Um, and also as you can see, um, her stepmother is red with anger. This is a tuba player and a uh, pianoist. And then I just walked by the throne. And there's a boy over there and a woman over there. And if we go over here, there's like drink, a flower, and some turkey. 
And then this is the Pancho flavor. I'm afraid to drink this, but I'm gonna drink it anyways. Hopefully nothing kills me. And click. This drink sure packs a punch. <laughs> yeah. But so I'm gonna go over here by the turkey, and there's a chest with Woofy in it. I don't want to eat Woofy. So there's cooked salmon, steak, cake, cooked chicken, bread, baked potatoes, cookies, and drink or water bottle in this case. And then uh, if we go over here, there's more paintings around the room, and there's a chandelier as well with some cool ceiling. And now I'm gonna head over and get on my well, not my throne, Prince Kai's throne, if I can jump on. And, okay, yes, I did it. Now I'm gonna read the rest of my paragraphs. And then, uh, yeah, starting now. My scene is Cinder and Emperor Kai dancing across in the, dancing in the floor with hundreds of people watching them dance across the floor. In the scene, people are surprised that Kai was dancing with a girl who is a mechanic and is wearing some really dirty clothes. I mean, who would expect an emperor to dance with her? Imagine the look on Cinder's stepmother's and sister's face. Everyone is surprised at this scene. Wouldn't you be too? I do think my work is literal because we all have that weird uncomfortable feeling inside that happens sometimes during school dances. For example, there are two or more very brave people who start dancing. Everyone just stares at them for a while and then they start pulling in people to dance and eventually everyone is dancing. Well, maybe not everybody because there's always a person in the corner stuffing their face with food, but you guys know what I mean. Why I thought this was an important scene because it shows how Cinder has feelings for Kai and how she came to the ball even though she said she couldn't go. Kai is very surprised to see her, but just as glad. The crowd was even more surprised than he was, and the probably Cinder's stepmother and sister were probably more surprised than everyone else. Another reason why this is an important scene is because after this scene, she finds out who she really is and who she really was. You will have to read the book to find out who she is. The reason I wanted to do this is because Minecraft is fun to do and it allows me to express my ideas through Minecraft. Minecraft is one of my favorite games and it is fun to make projects with it. I like a challenge. This is my art project. I hope you enjoyed my, this scene in the book, Cinder by Mercy. Cinder by Mercer Meyer. Now, in a few seconds, I'm gonna move my body if it decides to move. Please move, please. And I'm gonna show you uh, Cinder and Prince Kai and a little bit of a detour of the room really quickly again. Just have to wait for my character to move. One minute. Ah, here it goes. So, we are going to go and take another quick detour really quickly. So, there, uh, the broken glass. Uh, Cinder's stepmother made, or broke, in other words. Um, and then here's the stepmother, there's her sister, and um, there's the tuba player and pianoist over there, and the rest of the people, and, you can see, and the more paintings and everything is here. And I'm just gonna quickly exit out and tell you guys, thanks for watching. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed my video about Cinder and Prince uh, Kai dancing. Thank you.